In this vlog, it's day two in Barcelona, where we help Luke Woodham clean his rally cross drift car. We see some footage, we help Peden get ready for a first date. Whew, it's a goodie. You can check it out straight after this. Good morning. Much better with the window open. I don't know why I haven't done that before. <laughs> thank you, monster people. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. So it's a wet morning. Practice is at nine o'clock. So hopefully I can get you guys some shots. The problem we're gonna have, if I get any shots, I cannot release any of this footage till after Wednesday. But I think that's gonna work out okay anyway because of my timetable and trying to get these vlogs done. So things should be okay. So I need to go up this tower, cross the bridge, see what we can see. There's the tent, it's got Luke's stuff in it. Boom, excited to see his demos later. And then this, must be the bridge. Follow this through there, and I think I'll see the hairpin, hopefully. I had a 50-50 once I was over the bridge. That way, or this way? I'm gonna try this way. This thing is well dodgy. Oh, didn't sign up for this. Last one. <sighs> Ta da! This area down by the track isn't exactly amazing. So I'm gonna go back to that original place as I think that gets me to the grandstand. We've been back in, I got, I think I can only call it paddock, panic. Where it was just so cool watching the team doing what they're doing and I'm trying not to get in their way. Epic to see how much work goes into turning these things around ready for another practice session. So this time we we'll go for the grandstand. We've just seen Pernilla and Ollie head on out. Hopefully I get a good view. Grandstand sucked, so I'm gonna try those dodgy stairs and see if I can get on pre-grid. Black. Black did. to see both the drivers and even good old friend <laughs> back and give us a wave. I might try and catch him later in the paddock for you all. Hiya. Hello. <laughs> Oops. Turns out you're not meant to be in the wash bay. <laughs> Luke Woodham, demo time. So yeah, we, we came to the grandstand to film uh, that. Sorry Luke, you're at the other side. And we don't think you'll be allowed down here because these guys are cleaning up, so. Woo, go Luke, great Hello. demo. Hello, hi Luke. We'll maybe catch the afternoon one. Sorry dude. So we're on our way back from trying to catch Luke, but the 1600 supercars getting their wash. Really good scrub down before their races. Ooh, 
monster rig. So we're now down where Luke's car is at. Oh, it's looking a bit dirty. I think it's time we have a word. So, as you can see, Spain is lovely and sunny. <laughs> it's delightful, Luke. I'm really, really enjoying catching the back. I'm only joking. Look at the back of my car. <laughs> Luckily, it's coming off nice and easy with yeah. our highly pressured pressure washer. Yeah, so we're using the uh, broken, broken pressure washer. Right? You get well looked after by the FIA, Luke. Yeah, I mean, to be fair, like it's a drift car to a rallycross car now. It is absolutely filthy. But luckily, we've got the best product. And so we're going to blast it off now. Ching! And then we're going to give her a little polish up. Super. We'll be smelling of bananas afterwards. Get a tire shot on there, and then we're going to go out. That was really cool, I feel for Luke because the weather is terrible here and because all the rallycross cars are chewing up the track, you had a very small space to do that demo in. Car's wrecked with mud. We've got to try and clean up, ready for the next one. So it's time to head back up the paddock. I gotta switch the battery on this and see what is happening. I feel terribly sorry for this guy. Look, if the sun was shining, he would have had beautiful people in the sunshine playing his great music. But unfortunately, he's in a coat getting cold playing music to a swamp. I feel sorry for that guy. PSRX on! I need a coffee. So the time is now actually 12.51. Mm. And the gentlemen are setting up for lunch. Mm -mm. We have two minutes left until the guys have to be out for qualifying. We're currently watching the Euro RX. There's some hairy <laughs> racing going out there. The conditions are really difficult. It is proper chucking it down here. The guys are having to squeege all the dirt out. Ugh. What a shame I'm gonna have to sit in this nice building getting fed, watching it on TV. Ding! Thank you so much, Solberg crew. Sweet, so first race, first one done. Pet I got first, yes! We're just a race going on at the minute and then we're waiting to see how Johan does in his one. So a little update to quote the man himself. It is uh, crazy out there. So <laughs> just to survive and do as well as he did in first, he says there is a lot more pace, a lot more speed in the car. He, uh, he, just, he just wanted to finish. So that's good to hear. Times are cool. I'm learning this as fresh as new as you guys. So one more race and then it looks like Johan is next. So what's super cool is the man himself is back. We managed to film him for a bit on the official PSRX camera. He's talking about how slippy it is, how he's just survived, and he's actually speechless on how he's survived being out there and coming back. The adrenaline pumping through him. Can you imagine? He's finished the race and still got back here. It is crazy conditions out there, really testing the drivers, and it's cool to see that raw motion here in the paddock. <laughs> <laughs> so that's the racing done. I think it was a very good final race. I've missed it because Peden was wanting to grab some content. So we took a bimble up here to pre as he's not been here today yet. So I think these are the 1600s, which are going to have a lot of fun in this weather, I am sure. And this gentleman here, get up. there he is. Vloggers are going to vlog today. So this is pretty cool, you get the times right by the track as well, so the drivers of the teams waiting to go can get some information up here at the start. I think it's safe to say that was definitely a washout. These 1600s are cool, but they're just not ticking our bop, 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 box at the moment. <laughs> Look how dirty these things get between rounds. Christofferson's there. Now I'm interested, I can't see because of this Fiesta, but Solberg's is behind there. And we might have done some cheeky AM details work on that before it went out. So it'd be interesting to see 
Is it as dirty as Christophson's or not? Hmm. Always look after your main mechanic. That's right. The time is now half past six. Johan is doing like a mic'd up interview with this guy for official PSRX stuff. There is the man himself, Mr. Petter Solberg. But we're going to switch some cards on this camera and we're going to lend this to that rather dapper looking chap. And he gets to have a dinner date with him. Mm -mm. Look at that. Craig even cleans up for the dinner date. This is beautiful. Peden, you're getting spoiled. This is gonna be a beautiful, beautiful dinner. Right, let's set this thing up over here for the shot. Dinner date done. Peden nailed it, Johan nailed it. It went a little bit longer than should have, so hopefully it works out good. Mm. Time is now 21.28. I've just finished, uh, what day is it today? Saturday, Friday's vloggy thing. It's 20 minutes, so I hope you guys are gonna enjoy it. We are currently chilling out here. We have <laughs> the Peden, <-den. laughs> and we have Neil, we're chilling out. Because we're gonna have the Gymkhana video on here, so we're just gonna ah, relax crowbar. here. Relax here in a, the crowbar, relax the crowbar. here in the paddock. <laughs> enjoy the Gymkhana content. We've got Mr. Gymkhana, just right. Just poke Luke there, look. So we're gonna enjoy this guys, I'll catch up with you after. Unless something happens before that, then I will update you all. Time is now, what's that, half 10 on here, so it's half 11. Teams are still prepping, getting ready for tomorrow. But we are off. Off to the hotel to rest so I can come here tomorrow. And then you guys will come with me as the unexciting thing happens of us flying to Birmingham. <sighs> and I just want to say thank you John for taking me back to the hotel. You are a legend. You guys wouldn't believe actually how far it is to get from one side to the other side of that track. I hope you really did enjoy this video and it's the first time at RX and it's part of this catch up series and us supporting PSRX. If you did, then please do subscribe and smash the bell so you get a notification every time we go live. Plus, huh, over here, two videos chosen just for you. Ciao.